Platform as a service, or PaaS, the thing it means for banks in one word is simply innovation. What it really means technically is our architecture, which we've invested huge amounts of money in for the last several years, is now exposed to anybody who wants to deploy on top of it, develop on top of it, or operate from on top of it. So who could that be anybody? Well, it could be the banks themselves, the corporate developers, it could be individual developers, it could be systems integrators, it could be other software companies, it could be fintechs, and it can even be universities. So when we launched our pass, we had one example of each of those who are already consuming and developing their own applications from that platform as a service. Well, banks need innovation ever more quickly. They face an incredible challenge satisfying their customers, satisfying their regulators, getting back to the business of growth. And much of this is going to be driven by innovation. So the speed of innovation and the speed by which innovation can be consumed is more important than ever. Well, third parties now can access an infrastructure which they don't need to replicate. They don't need to replicate single sign-on or security or development environment. We give that to them all as part of the platform as a service. So they can do ever more work ever more quickly. The parallel, if you like, is uh, iTunes. If I'm an applications developer on Apple, I develop my application using the Apple environment. I don't need to create my own environment. Well, now the same is true for the financial services industry. Yeah, so take a, a really strange situation the world is in right now. Several geographies are in a world of negative interest rates. That's never happened before. So many of the models that are out there for predicting portfolio returns and margins no longer apply in a world of negative interest rates. So many universities at the professorial level are trying to work out new algorithms to how you plan a portfolio to make money when interest rates are negative. Now that valuation as a service has been done by the uh, University College of London uh, using our platform as a service. So now it's an algorithm uh, that can be consumed by banks or by quantitative mathematics people uh, all around the world.